Hello beautiful souls, it's Karen here at Soul Magic Inspirations and Star Child Tarot and I wanted to do a reading from the angels and the archangels so this is messages for the holiday season for those that want, want a message, okay so I just want to say a big thank you to everyone who supported me uh, thanks for your love and support this time. If you're new here, welcome. I hope you enjoy my content. Please subscribe, like, share, comment. It's free and it really helps my channel go grow. Check out my shorts as well. There's a few short videos. Um, check out my Etsy shop, my Patreon and my deck shop, Over 90 Designs. If you join my Patreon, it's just $5 a month. And you get um, first look at some videos and some are going to be exclusive. And when you join, I will give you a free reading as a thank you once first payment is received. So several ways to get a free reading. There will be a competition coming up in the new year as well of winning a free reading as well. So let's get on with the messages. So we've got the angel of pleasure. Take pleasure in the things you do. Yeah, it's important that we do find pleasure in our life. You know, life isn't all about work and hard times. We need to find the joy, the pleasure. And the angel of expression, speak your truth and express yourself clearly. So, you know, don't be afraid to be authentic, to speak your truth. And the angel of finances, honour and give thanks for the blessings you're about to receive. So it looks like there's blessings coming towards you in finances. Angel of healing, the angels have felt your sadness and they're showing up today to send you healing. How beautiful is that? So a lot of you obviously, you know, going through a sad period. As you know, I've been going through that myself. So they want to know that they're around you, sending you healing. Angel of clearing, your time of waiting and confusion will soon be over. So yeah, clearing your space, clearing your energy. And angel of union, a partnership is blessed and destined for great for greatness. So for some of you, you know, you could be coming into union with somebody very soon. I'm not saying it's going to be over the holiday season, but you never know. And for those of you already in, in a, a relationship, in a, a connection, it's, it's going to be great. It's going to be a really great connection. So let's go a bit deeper with these messages. So we've got Angel of Pleasure. So what do they want you to know around that? We've got the High Priestess Energy, powerful psychic insights, reflection and meditation that provides valuable information, be at peace. So they want you to find peace in your life and acknowledge that life is a balance of work and play and pleasure. And we've got Emperor Energy here, stability and efficiency, taking charge of a situation, ambitious plan. So connect with your masculine energy, your masculine part. And, you know, taking action to have fun, to have more pleasure in your life. What else can you tell us about that? And I'm using the um, Power Tarot. tarot. So we have got the two of Raphael here. Two hearts dedicated to creating something wonderful. Kindred spirits don't give up on those you love so you know some of you could be you know in separation from somebody right now and they're saying don't give up on those you love i mean you can still love people from a distance um you know but it does look like there could be somebody coming towards you this could be somebody new for some of you and i feel that the two of you are going to have those beautiful fun times together a very loving connection and don't be afraid to speak your truth yeah and we've got this seven of gabriel stand up for what you believe in have confidence claim your personal power so speak your truth you know if you see some injustices or you're being treated unfairly speak up you know don't let people get away with that okay you know be brave speak your truth and angel of finances there are blessings about to come towards you so let's have a look what's that talking about there so some financial blessings. We've got three of Michael. Release the past. You will grow from the situation. Time heals all wounds. 
so yeah you could have been through a heartbreak through you know difficult times and we need to do that healing and let go of the past and we've got six to gabriel congratulations you've done a wonderful job time to move on to the next project awards scholarships or promotions so we can see that there is financial rewards coming towards you here um for something you've been doing okay and we've got the moon this opportunity to improve your plans listen to your intuition for accurate guidance face your fears and grow stronger so don't let fear hold you back okay move forward positively use that moon energy we've got the super moon coming up and use that moon energy to put those intentions out there but there are blessings coming towards you and yes the angels are around you giving you healing so what else can you tell us about that us about that healing tell us about that healing wow six of Raphael embrace your inner child new friends or rekindled relationships children or childhood so you know nurture your inner child we, a lot of us do have inner child wounding and that reflects in that playful energy. They want you to connect with your inner child, that playful side, have fun, let loose, you know, be childlike, um, be free, embrace your inner child. And we've got new friends or rekindled relationship, and we did see that two of cups energy there. So for some of you, it could be somebody you've known a long time is returning. And we've got a angel clearing, time to clear your energy, okay? Material needs get fulfilled in magical and unexpected ways, acts of kindness, giving or receiving with a grateful heart. So you're going to come into balance, I feel. You know, once you come into balance of your own energy, it's like the, the masculine, the feminine, the dark, the light, the negative, the positive, the, um, the mind and the heart. When you're in that balance, that energy, you will attract what you desire, what you deserve and there will be balance, so you have enough, you have enough to give, and you have enough for you. And Angel of Union, we've got the King of Raphael here. Yes, it's safe to trust, the ability to accomplish many things at once, follow your creative passions, warm, generous, honourable, refined. So this could be the person that's coming towards you, okay, somebody that's, you know, in those energies, What else can you tell us about this union? Yeah, we've got Tanner Gabriel. Ask your angels for helpful people to lighten your load. Working too many hours, trying too hard to please others. So like Cinderella, maybe you've been overworking, but the 10 is the end. It's time to put down those burdens. And they are sending people to help you. And I feel... You know, one of these people is this this connection, this relationship, okay? And it is going to help you balance out your life and not do overworking, spending time doing fun things as well. And we've got the world, Archangel Michael, a very happy ending, coming full circle, spiritual growth and insight. So a whole new chapter of your life is starting here. Yeah, we've got Eight of Gabriel, a great deal of activity, Sudden and immediate results, important communication. So yeah, there's important communication coming towards you and things are going to start moving forward quickly here. And Paige Gabriel, energetic, brave, optimistic and playful. Follow your passion, you're ready for any challenge, opportunities for excitement and adventure. So I feel that this person coming in is going to offer you that and they are, they have these uh, qualities, they're energetic, they're brave, they're optimistic and playful and they will match your energy. So it will really be good um, match for you. And we've got a positive new emotional experience, fulfilling romantic relationships, deep and lost in spiritual insight. So it's definitely a spiritual connection and we've got the lovers here, Archangel Raphael. 
make choices from your heart deeply emotional commitments the power of love wow so never give up on the power of love i mean <laughs> every time i do a reading it turns into a love reading but that's the energies so you know take what resonates for you so let's get your other messages so we've got signs and reminders. So I feel your angels are sending you signs and reminders. We've got butterflies. You're going through a transformation. We've got these birds. I'm not sure what they're called there. But they're sending you signs through nature, maybe. Through um, the clouds. Through the moon and stars. Through birds. Okay, so look out for those signs. And the answer is a yes. Okay, so there's a positive answer for your maybe you've had a question in your mind the answer is yes and i forgot to say at the end of the reading we are going to ask the, i want you to ask the angels a question and there's going to be three choices okay so you can pick your answer and joy and content joy and contentment are coming towards you here so a much more happier fulfilling time coming towards you just trust have faith and belief and angelic protection they want to know they want you to know you're protected this is archangel michael he is the strong protector you can call on him whenever you don't feel safe or supported call on archangel michael to help protect you but the protection is there available just call on him and cut the cords yeah cut the cords again you can call on archangel michael to help you cut the cords of attachment to people places situations that are holding you back okay it doesn't mean to say that you cut them out of your life you're cutting away that energy the draining of energy if you feel drained and tired it's because you have too many cords attaching you to people and ease and grace you know go through your life with ease and grace this is your life is going to become easier as you move into grace okay as you move into that peaceful state of grace and listen deeply they have messages for you they're trying to connect with you so go into meditation go into nature go into silence and listen deeply for their messages okay they've got some messages for you and holy love they want you to know you're truly loved okay you cannot imagine the love that they have for you they're sharing this love they want you to feel that love okay that they are sending to you right now and compassion they have so much compassion for you and everyone in this world and they want you to be in that energy of compassion as well and send that out to others and obviously give that to yourself be compassionate to yourself and spiritual growth this this is a very you know this planet is a really good place for spiritual growth for soul growth for soul lessons okay so you are going through a phase of spiritual grace uh, growth so be kind to yourself be nurturing be loving be compassionate to yourself opportunity for, to forgive the situation brings you the opportunity to heal grow and release negative patterns hold the intention of seeing the good the other person's inner divine light and goodness we will help you release unforgiving thoughts feelings and energies and lift you to a higher place of peace and, and compassion so it's time to forgive okay the um hawaiian prayer and i can never say that word is such a beautiful affirmation to say and you know forgive yourself and forgive others okay because holding on to that is just keeping you stuck and acceptance see yourself and others through the eyes of the angels with unconditional love and acceptance in this way you inspire and lift everyone to the highest potential so be, be in that energy i know it's not always easy but be in that energy have that unconditional love for self and others at this time and child you care deeply about children and they readily respond to your love all children including your own inner child require love affection and attention we can clear and open your heart and, sh and schedule so you can give more time and energy to the children who need you. So these children can be any age. I mean, I have children that are grown up and they they still need their mom, you know, their dad. You know, they still, you know, we still love them. We still want to be there for them and acknowledge your inner child as well. This needs attention right now. OK, they need some attention. We had that come out earlier so nurture and love your inner child and allow that inner child to come out to play and we have akasha you are a spiritual teacher 
You have the ability to counsel others and help them awaken their spiritual gifts and divine life mission. So again, you could be an example to others right now. And patience, now is the time to learn, study and gather information. Enjoy being a student because in the future you will synthesize your knowledge into action. So again, there could be time for you to study, to go into some sort of learning, you know, really do that inner work, do that he inner healing on yourself, do that, have that awakening, open up to receive information from your guides, your angels, or just in the 3D, you know, just studies, just keep an open mind. And Isaiah, it's a good time to give birth to new ideas and situations in your life. I'm watching over you, guiding and protecting you during these changes. So again, another energy of protection, you are protected. And divine order, so these are the Archangel messages now. We have Archangel Raguel. Everything is how it needs to be right now. Look past the illusion and, and see underlying order. Okay, so things will on plan things are on target even though it may not seem like that to you they're just confirming that and archangel raziel clairvoyance i'm helping your spiritual sight to awaken fully so you can clearly see heavenly love so yeah you're opening up to that inner knowing that inner sensing okay so you can really feel their love and sense them around you and sensitivity archangel hanel you are extra sensitive to energies and emotions right now Honour yourself and your feelings. So you could be a very highly sensitive empath. Empath, You really feel others' pain, others' feelings. So protect and, and take care of you right now. And honour your sensitivity. Don't overdo it. Be gentle with yourself. And overcoming difficulties, Archangel Jeremiah. The worst is now behind you and you are surmounting any previous challenges. Wow. And spread your wings, Archangel Ariel. Do not hold back right now. The timing is perfect and you're ready to soar. So they want you to spread your wings. They want you to take that leap of faith. And brilliant idea, Archangel Uriel. Yes, your idea is divinely guided. Please take action to bring your idea to fruition. So these two go together, I feel. Whatever your idea is, it's time. Okay, they're, they're encouraging you to move forward. And again, compassion, Archangel Zachiel. Soften your heart with, with respect to this situation and all the people involved, including yourself. So, beautiful energies. I'm just going to do the pick a pile. So, think of a question and then we're going to finish off with Archangel Michael's messages to you. So, think of a question in your mind that you need an answer to. And we're going to have three piles. So, think of a question. So pile one, how to, what's their answer? And pile three, pile three is answer. So this is the Angel Answers deck. So pile one, think of your, what was your question? So the answer is trust. So they want you to have trust, faith and belief really um, in whatever is going on for you at this time. Okay, trust and surrender to what is happening around you. Okay, because you're on the right path. So pile two, so your answer is there's something better. So whatever is going on with you, there is something better out there for you. Um, there's a better solution. There's a better way. And I feel the inspiration will be coming to you soon. So just focus on that. Just ask for guidance on that, okay? And pile three, we have peaceful resolution. So again, something is coming to a peaceful resolution for you, whatever that is, okay? So just take that as a, as a positive, okay? So beautiful. So let's finally get Archangel Michael's messages. So we've got honour and trust your feelings. Thank you, Archangel Michael, for supporting, guiding and protecting me as I listen to and act upon my feelings. Help me understand and express my emotions with love. So honour and trust your feelings. You know, this is your intuition. This is your heart space. Okay, so follow that. Follow your intuition. Follow your heart space. 
and sometimes we get conflicted with our thoughts and some our mind we need to get out of that and get into our heart space our feelings and write about your thoughts and feelings archangel michael thank you for helping me tap into my god-given creativity and wisdom so i clearly express myself and glean insight blessing and healing so again if you're going through something really difficult they're wanting you to write this down in some way and by sharing it with others it will be healing for you and it will help others heal as well and give them support and guidance and encouragement at this time and finally we have go forward fearlessly archangel michael thank you for walking with me every step of the way for holding my hand giving me confidence and courage and guiding my thoughts and actions in the direction of love and my true life's purpose so you know go forward fearlessly so feel the fear and do it anyway sometimes we do feel fearful of change of new and archangel michael is ready to be by your side you can call on him to walk by your side to hold your hand to give you the confidence and courage to assist you with your thoughts at this time and your actions and direct you in the right right way so beautiful messages so wishing you all a really happy holidays and a happy new year lots of love and blessings take care